Hey, man, how's the great writer? <laughs> That's great, mate. <laughs> um, I am so hungover. I must have had 60 beers last night. <laughs> and maybe a bottle of absinthe. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind about that. Look, the pud has come through for you again. Two stinking hot chicks. All for you, be ready at five. Not um, taken, no. The pud is your bud. Two chicks. Two. Hey, Stud had to go last night. Oh, you mean with the mother and her young daughter? Still, two stinking hot chicks. Hyperbole, Alex. Unnecessary. Oh, well, don't worry about that, my friend. I have an absolute stunner for you tonight. Alex, I really don't think... <laughs> no, 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 no. She's right up your alley, this one. She's really smart. She's the smartest girl I know. Really? Yeah. She reads heaps. I don't really read books. Yeah. They take forever. I like reading Cleo. Idea. The day. Sorry, Neil, you, you stopped. 
startled me. Uh, yes, um, yeah, I'm startled. <laughs> you. <laughs> uh, how are these notes you left me? Sorry. Just take a deep breath. Take your time. <laughs> these notes are very... I corrected some. You corrected them? Yes, some. Flowers. Flowers. I have flowers for you. Thank, thank you. Uh, yes. Um, your notes. Your writing was terrible, but it's the best writing I've ever read. These notes of poetry to me it doesn't fit. I'm sorry. I, the, I find the written word much more easy to express myself than oration. I mean, conversation. And yes, I hope you enjoy the flowers. Hey, Neil. I'm going to poetry reading. Do you want to come? <laughs> <laughs> 